Welcome to Real Issue Podcast. I'm your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, if you are a Miami Heat fan, continue to like, share, comment, subscribe. Thank you for all the support. And if you're an NBA fan, subscribe to the channel. And thank you for all the support. So we know that Damian Lillard has been traded to the Milwaukee Bucks. And Jimmy Butler, he responded on social media. He said, yo, NBA, man, y'all need to look into the Bucks for tampering. Y'all didn't hear from me, but I heard it from somebody. Now, at the end of the day, I just think that Pat Riley, he dropped the ball tremendously. You finally had a star who said he wanted to come to Miami and only Miami. And for some strange reason, I know for a fact Pat Riley wanted to play cheap. Once again, I know we had Nikola Jovic and Jaime Hawkins Jr., but you have to give them up for Damian Lillard. You have to. But it's weird because the Portland Trailblazers, they took Drew Holiday, an older point guard. Why wouldn't they take the Miami Heat's assets that fit their timeline? Jaime Hawkins Jr. and Nikola Jovic, they can easily play with Simons and Scoot and all the other guys that they got. They have a young crew over there with Sharp as well. I don't understand why they would take Drew Holiday. I understand that DeAndre Hayden fits their timeline, and that's fine. Also, too, we had three first-round draft picks that we could have potentially put on the line. That's why I want to know what exactly did the Miami Heat offer. I just think that Pat Riley was trying to be too cheap. And with a guy like Damian Lillard who can change this Miami Heat team literally overnight, you can't be cheap. We cannot continue to get to the Eastern Conference Finals or the NBA Finals and then run out of gas. How how much longer is Jimmy Butler and Bam Adebayo going to carry this team day in and day out? Okay, we're going to have a mid-roster throughout the whole season, all because we don't want to give up a few extra pieces to get Damian Lillard. And I understand the Miami Heat, they're going to come out and say, we love our team. That's absolutely nonsense. We've been getting to the Eastern Conference Finals and the NBA Finals. I want to win a chip. Jimmy Butler's window is closing. Jimmy and Bam wanted Damian Lillard here. Dame wanted to be with the Miami Heat. I just think some of it is on Pat. Some of it is on the Blazers. I think that Joe Cronin, he really didn't want to send Dame Miller to the Miami Heat because when you look at what he even received back in return, like I said, DeAndre Ayton is good. You know, I think that we could have probably gave them all of our first round draft picks. I think that it's strange that they didn't want to take Tyler Hero, but they took Drew Holiday, who, who's an older point guard. So there's a little bit of weird things going on with that. But I just think that Pat Riley dropped the ball. I'm not saying that you had to give up all of our assets, but you got to give up damn near majority. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 3,000 subscribers.